Good morning guys. In today's video I'm going to show you how to fill the chi in your body between your hands so you can use it to do in healing on yourself or healing on other people. Chi is an energy that is within the human body and throughout the universe and by learning certain breathing techniques and meditation techniques you can direct this chi into your own body for your own health or into other people to heal them. The exercise we're going to do today is very simple. All you need to do is sit in a quiet place and just put your hands together like this. We're going to do two things. The first thing we're going to do, which is the easiest way to experience chi, is just rub the hands together like this. This actually stimulates the chi energy and will make it easy for you to actually feel in the next part of this video. So let's run for a few seconds. And when you've done that, just get your two fingers like this. Very slowly, move your fingers together. And at some point, you will feel like a coolness on your hand, like a palm of your hand, like cool air. And I can actually feel that there. That's actually chi energy. It's very, very subtle. You might find it easier to actually close your eyes and do it. And when you've got to this stage, you're just starting to develop your sensitivity to feel in chi okay so very very lightly you can see that my fingers just about half an inch away and i can feel like a cool breeze on my hand that's actually chi that's the most simply way to the simplest way to experience it but the way we're going to do it now is learn to, to learn to actually construct a chi energy ball between the hands and to do this you really need to, to sit or stand in a comfortable position i want you to place your arms by your side and just put your hands slightly apart like that with fingers slightly bent and all you're going to do is move them together and apart very very slowly like this just very very slowly apart together apart together now what you're actually doing now you're actually compressing the chi between your hands and as you become more experienced in this, and do this as a regular practice, you will find the chi becomes stronger and stronger. But that's only part of the story to actually developing chi. You need to learn how to breathe correctly, which also strengthens the chi. But just for now, just for now, move your hands together and apart. And I want you to imagine between your hands is a ball of energy. And as you imagine this ball of energy in your hands, and as you become apart and together, you will feel again this slight coolness. And this slight coolness, like air, is actually the chi energy. And I can feel that now getting stronger and stronger. And as you do this more and more, just nice and slowly, the tighter the hands are together, the more the ball of energy is compressed. So the further it is apart, I can't feel it there, but I can feel it there. And it feels like I'm squeezing a rubber ball between my hands. What I want you to do now is just close your eyes and carry on together, apart, together, apart, together, apart. Visualising the ball of energy between your hands, together, apart. Feeling the energy, it's very subtle apart and when you've done this you've got this ball of energy what you can actually do you can use it to heal yourself by putting it into your own body which is very simple just direct it in like this or if you're healing somebody you can actually send the energy to them okay you're not actually depleting your own energy because the the chi energy pervades the whole of the universe but what we can do, we can actually increase its power within us. And I'll do that in the next video. But one of the other things you need to know how to do is breathe correctly. Now, to increase chi in your body, all you need to do is close your eyes, breathe in, and breathe out. In and out. But as you breathe in and out, you breathe in through your nose, and out through your mouth. So your lungs are filled with energy, but at the same time, I want you to imagine 
you're actually inhaling with your own body. So imagine your whole body is a giant sponge, okay? And as you breathe in, it fills up with energy. And as you breathe out, it leaves you. So what you're actually doing now, you're bringing the chi into your body at a cellular level. Through imagining your whole body as a giant sponge, you're actually stimulating all the cells in your body to bring the chi into you. Again, in the next video, I'll teach you how to store the chi in your body, which actually increases its power. But just for now, close your eyes, breathe in, and out. And out and really feel the chi just building between your hands as you breathe and open your eyes and just kind of release the chi into the energy so again imagine your whole body is a giant sponge when you're breathing in imagine your whole body is breathing in energy every single pore of your body is open and bringing in this energy and as you breathe out it's expelling negative energy and that's one of the, the first basic steps in developing chi in the next video i'll show you how to actually store the chi in your body which increases its power and expel negative energy and what you will find after a while with this practice when you go out into nature um, into the countryside you will start seeing the chi around plants um, like energy streams um, when I first started doing this many years ago, I lived down in Hastings, and one of the first things I noticed, I was sitting in a field, and I could literally see energy everywhere, coming out of all the plants, all the trees, and it's like a slight shimmering grey-blue haze, is the only way to describe it, going from the earth to the sky, that's chi. But we'll do that more in the next video, um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, my website is www.ianbroadmore.com, I'm an energy healer, a teacher and an author um if you like any information please do leave a comment because i do always i do always read them and reply to them but just for now just practice the chi exercise between your hands every single day it only takes 10 minutes a day and what you'll find is the more you actually do this you will increase the energy and that's the key point increasing the chi energy and eventually when, you, when you're fully in control of this energy you'll actually be able to use it to actually move objects um apparently by the powers of the mind which i have got in another video set file to a piece of paper but these are all very trivial um it should really be used i think for the betterment of humanity and for that i believe healing is is the best use for it anyway it's all for now thanks for listening um have a great day my name's ian